Hey everybody, welcome to my little tutorial on hook bows. I'm gonna show you what they are, how they work, and where they go. We're mostly gonna focus on two different kind of contexts for hook bows. One is something that we use more in sort of old time style and you know, just sort of regular fiddle tunes and sometimes even in the middle of a Texas style or contest tune, but it goes in the middle of a section. And the other kind is where we use it at the end of a section to kind of punctuate, you know, the end of a part. But either way, the technique is the same. It's just where you put it and kind of how you use it. So I'm going to show you both of those. But let's get started with the actual technique itself. So the first thing we're going to do is we're just going to use open strings to start with. We're going to start with the A. And we're going to do a down bow. And then we're going to go to the D string, pivot over. And on the up bow, we're going to move through it and grab the A string, but then we're going to keep the two of them together. That's the most important thing. We're not going to lose the D string. It's not going to be like that. It's and the two of them together. So it's down, and when we get to the two together, we bring the hand down like that and give it a little extra oomph and that's part of the rhythm, the groove that you're creating with the hook bow there. So now let's try it with the first finger on the A string. So we're going to do open, oh, one, like that. And the reason I'm showing it to you this way is that a lot of hook bows, the fingers move in between the down bow and the up bow. So. something like that. So practicing putting a finger down or lifting a finger up, you might go, so like, something like that. So you might have fingers that change in between. So you wanna be aware of that. So you know the tune Angelina Baker, just kind of a classic, you know, basic tune. We're gonna use some hook bows in Angelina Baker so I can show you how they work in there. So. 